Good afternoon and thanks for watching today. At least a dozen children sat inside a Kentucky school bus as, as it was shot at. The Clark County bus was near the Yorktown trailer park when someone shot at it with a BB gun breaking a window. No one was injured, but the bus monitor was hit by some debris and now a student is facing charges. Janet Kim is live in Clark County with today's top story at 5. Janet? Well, Sam, this is the letter all 6,000 students in the Clark County School District took home to parents explaining an incident that left this window here shattered. It was an unwelcome break in a daily routine. It was a, a BB from a BB gun was fired from a mobile home as the bus drove down the street. The incident happened Monday afternoon while Clark County's bus number 53 unloaded students at the Yorktown Mobile Estates. 17 students were still on board, along with a bus monitor and driver. Anytime anything is thrown or fired, shot toward a bus load of students, it obviously it could be extremely uh, hazardous and dangerous to those on board. Clark County school officials say though the bus monitor was sitting where the BB hit the window, no one was injured and the person responsible was caught quickly thanks to surveillance video like this taken on board every bus. This system has dramatically reduced our disciplinary problems uh, and yes in this particular system this made short order of what could have taken many, many days and many, many hours of questioning of students and maybe not getting accurate information. But some parents still can't help but to feel uneasy and they're hoping even more precautions can be taken. I mean, there needs to be more security for school buses. I mean, there's fights on school buses, there's shootings now being done at school buses. Clark County school officials say they want parents to know they aren't taking this situation lightly and plan to prosecute to the fullest extent of the law. School officials say they plan to pursue felony wanton endangerment charges, possibly account for each person that was on board. Reporting live in Clark County, Janet Kim, WKYT 27 News First. And we're told the person arrested is a minor and a student at the alternative school in Clark County. The student was not in school yesterday because of a previous 